this for four or eight months of dizzy. I'm starting to feel motion sickness for for love. Hello everybody, my name is Dizzy and welcome back to some Assassin's Creed 2. Starting off with a big thank you to Boom Boom so much for subscribing with Prime no less. Uh, you are a superstar, you are my superstar and I very much enjoyed seeing you at the weekend. Uh, it's wonderful to see you here now today. Hopefully you will also all be enjoying watching old Ezio. Uh, just need to tab out so I can actually <laughs> twiddle the things. Um, I'm watching old Ezio. Uh, get to whatever it was we were doing. Hopefully with a controller that might actually be working. Give me one second. Um, it's fine. This is all good. This is all working exactly how it should be. <laughs> this says oh, it's, it's a different game. Okay, fair point. Young Ezio, although much older Ezio than when we started. Although it hasn't really felt like time has been passing, the numbers at the bottom have been telling us that actually it's been like over a decade, I think, since the start of the game. Oh, this is really not a good start. <laughs> With the old controller being a pain. <clears throat> Forgive me while I just tear my hair out ever so slightly. This is fine. This is all fine. Uh, tell me how you've been getting on chat. Tell me how, how you've been doing. Uh, uh, how your day has been. Any plans you have for the coming week. It's nearly December. It's nearly like Christmas season. We've got a week and a bit left. Isn't that terrifying? Hmm. We're gonna be fine. It's all gonna be fine. Okay, we've taken the extraordinary step of using a different uh, USB port, and that seems to be working better for us. Um, it says you had a big thing of hot Thai rice for breakfast. Ooh, yummy, scrummy. I think I think while I was away for the weekend, my parents ended up having Thai because there's an unopened pack of Thai style crackers on the uh I don't know, is that a loot chest? Oh, it's a loot chest, but it's a loot chest already with it. Uh yes, there's an unopened pack of Thai style crackers on the oh, that's too high. Uh on the side in the kitchen that I desperately want to get my claws into, but because it is an unopened pack, I haven't had the opportunity to do so yet. Uh I have no idea where we are. I've just realised. 
Oh, we're at Monte Gianni. Have I picked up money from a treasure chest? Let's go check the treasure chest, see if it needs anything picking up from it. Um, yeah, so last time, we did, I think, all of the DLC content that I didn't actually know we had. Excuse me. Everyone. I'm a, I'm a man on a mission, and that mission is for money. Uh, so we went to Borgli, uh, which ended up being attacked while uh, Lady Katerina was outside chilling with us. There we go, loads of money, excellent. Uh, and we ended up having to chase this monk guy back to Florence. It turned out he'd like taken over Florence uh, in a populist uprising. Oh, that sounded meaty. Jesus. Oh. Um. <laughs> and he was burning books and stuff, and we did some good old-fashioned Assassin's Creed 1 style, just like assassinating all of the vaguely important people in the city. Uh, which was good fun. Uh, but now we are back on our mission. I guess we got a... Oh, we've got a mission here. Where is our quest? Oh, our mission is here. Oh, god damn it. That's why we're here. If I learned to actually read my mini map, I'm sure it would do me a great service. <laughs> uh, yes, now I'm assuming we're going to be back on the track of the prophet. We've discovered that I am apparently the Templar's fated prophet, which I'm sure. Hang on. No, we're on the track of the Spaniards. We can tell that I'm the prophet, which I'm sure they're not tremendously happy about. Uh, and also, Leonardo da Vinci has set up shop here in our home. Uh, which uh, will be lovely to be able to see him more often. Ooh, hello. What's going on? The data stream is corrupted. Oh. No, scratch that. This says it's incomplete. Hmm. It's the Codex pages. It looks like Ezio had them all when this memory occurred. Okay. Great. And how am I supposed to find them? Hold on. It looks like Ezio has a map on him. He must have picked it up during one of the corrupted sequences. Oh, good, right. According to this, it'll show you the location of any missing codex pages. I, I assume that was scripted. That I wouldn't have them all by now? Because I've picked up every single one that I've been able to find. Uh, I don't actually know how to... Where, where is that? I've lost the tutorial now. Uh, oh, look, we have someone in the chat who is uh, a lovely little bot who we need to go and get rid of. Everybody, point at the bot. And and yes, Boom Boom already has the idea. Hiss and boo at the bot. And get ready for your ceremonial banning. Goodbye. Don't come back. Uh, we actually haven't got many of those in a while. I wonder if they think, like, now that I'm actually an affiliate, they think I'm, in air quotes, too big. And I do heavily stress those air quotes to, uh, to actually need to buy view bots and followers and what have you. Um, how do I, how do I use this thing? Do I need to, can I zoom, do I need to? I can't zoom in to any location I'm not at. So I don't really know where the other page is going to be. Which is awkward. Unless it's down here with this other bloody gem that I've been completely unable to find. Unless it's on the roof. It's not on the roof, is it? That would make me feel really stupid if it was on the roof. Well, oh, maybe I can't I can't climb up this bit of window. You know, for assassins, your house is remarkably unclimbable. I don't think it's up here. <clears throat> Have I ever been into this room? Hmm. I'm not sure. Maybe I need to go and explore the house. Right. Go up the stairs. 
double check to see if there are any paintings I'm missing. I don't think there are. I think we got them all. It looks like we got them all. And it says that room does have interesting stuff in it. It does, doesn't it? There was one, like, super secret sneaky room I found a way up to. <laughs> Though now I can't remember where I found a way up to it from. Here, or is it out there? Oh, yeah. It's very troubling being this un <laughs> unintelligent sometimes. Uh, oh, do I have any feathers to give? I do. There we go. How are we doing for feathers? Plus thirty value, fifty-six feathers. Oh, it's up here. Here's the way up that I found previously. Is this the room that I saw? Yeah, this is the room that I saw now. Oh, I, I, I had a prompt for what this room is. I think this is portraits of my targets. Or the people I've stabbed. And yeah, no, uh, no loot in here. This is very vexing. Up there. Um. Ergo, it must be down. But I never did find the way down. I went into the mines, and it wasn't through the mines. Hmm. Is it through this fountain thing at the front here? Is there like a secret entrance? See one. There's nothing that looks like a secret entrance. Ah, oh, look. See, so as we go up, you see right, right now, they they at this level here, they the, the icons turn from being like hazy to being not hazy, which means that we are we do need to be down. Why? Never mind. I don't want to know. But how do we get over there while being down at this level? Hmm. Is there a way around? A sneaky side entrance somewhere? Oh. Have you been this sort of looks like we're going up. Up is not down. And there aren't any sneaky entrances anyway. Only non-sneaky entrances. Hmm. What about over on this side? We seem very... Oh, this... Unlock this map through the Ubisoft Club. Okay, it's possible that that's it, I guess, and the way to get those bonus chests is just to pay Ubisoft money, which feels off if it is the case. Is that a feather up there? No, it's a statue! I think this is... No, this isn't the last statue. I've still got one more after this, I think. How perplexing. But yeah, either way, there doesn't seem to be a codex page icon down there. Like, there's two icons of which I can only see one. So it's possible the other one is a codex page? But... I'm assuming it isn't. Uh, there we go. Ooh. Goodies? Goodies! We love goodies! <laughs> So it's not a codex page as far as you remember. Okay, we will... It's not down here, is it? <clears throat> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Has this been here the whole time? Also, what do you want... Oh, you want to go up here, I see. 
Uh, down onto here. Onto here. Yes, across to this. And then over to here. Oh, that's not where I thought you were going to go, but that works too. Okay. Whoop, okay, I need a yump. And then another yump. And then a slightly off angled yump. Yump. Amazing. After all this time, <laughs> I've been being perplexed by these chests. <laughs> Probably a safe way back from here. Oh my gosh. Right, so that, that definitely wasn't the codex pages we now have confirmed. Uh, so that means we need to go and find them somewhere else. Unfortunately, we don't know where the somewhere else is going to be. Down to the floor, but not quite like that, Ezio. Not quite like that. Alright, let's get the heal. There, I'd love a heal. Uh, find the door. Find the fast travel guy. Hi. Right. I don't know where it's going to be. If I had to guess... No, let's just take them all in order. Let's we'll take all the maps in order. And then we'll see which one has a codex page that I've managed to miss by being a numpty. Ooh! Let's see if it's very dashing in a circle like that. Well, apparently I'm slightly wanted here. That's fine, I'm sure. Uh, okay. No codex pages. Blanche is always the least likely one. So that doesn't super surprise me. Uh, Tuscany. San Gimignano. Oh, lots of chests around. That's a treasure. I haven't extensively looted the Tuscany, but there's no. Nothing that looks like a codex page, is there? That's a hammer. Happy to say it's probably not here. Uh, then we have Romana Forgly. Folly, sorry. And the other the other thing about Folly is there's one other Romania map that I guess I can't fast travel to. That's the mountains area. So I should probably, if it's not here. Oh yes, there's also the, the being able to fly the fly thing we have available here. Okay, if it's not here, which it seems like it isn't, I also need to go and find the mountain trail. Then we can do on horseback and check out that map area. Right. Um it's me, I'm just gonna steal a horse. Horse and Yes. 
just yeah to the mountains yeah okay hey hey leave me be but if you all got out of the way this would be a lot less painful for everyone especially my horse yes i'd like to go to the mountain though i think i hit that one as well whoopsies <laughs> I can't change weapon on the screen. I can only ever use my fists. Right. Codex pages. Oh, there's a huge. Oh, oh. There's a huge bit of this map around here that isn't revealed, which is strange because I don't seem to have any lookout point to reveal it from. Yeah. I guess we weren't really expected to come back here. I guess I can't get... Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm getting, I'm getting, getting out, I'm getting out. Jesus. <laughs> um, hmm. Okay. Not here. I will grab this little chest as soon as it happens to be right in front of us. Oh, apparently I won't. <laughs> Having real difficulty getting off this horse and staying off this horse. <laughs> we'll turn back. Go back to Forley, which means the only place it can be in, presumably, is Venice. Right? That's that's logic and facts and deductive reasoning. <laughs> I knew I was doing the right thing being anal obsessive about finding them all. Uh, where's the way? I think it's over here. Excuse me, sir. Hi there. I would like one of your finest venices, please. This says only logic and facts here. True. Very true. I spent so much money on fast travel. <laughs> I really haven't, objectively speaking. It's like a hundred apart, but it feels like it. Okay. Now, Venice is a big map. Um, look! There's a whole new area! Up here! That I haven't, like, done anything for. Okay, well. Guess we've got to, got to, do, got to go do lots of uh, explorer marating. Uh, not that way, apparently. I've, I've unfortunately picked the worst place to fast travel to out of all the options because it's on the opposite side of the city. Excuse me, guys. Somewhere over the rainbow. Uh, oh my god, there's so many groups of armed guys around. Jesus. This is a rough bit of Venice. Oh, if there's a new area, that means that the painters will have a new thing for me. So I'm actually going to stop at this guy. Sneak. Sneak. Yeah, find the painter. Uh, inside this building. Treasure map. And the Reggio. Yes, I would like a Canna Reggio treasure map, please. Oh, I've got a Right. Do we have to have a convenient boat? We have a loot boat. We do not have a, a rowing boat. Unfortunately. This is a huge area that seems to only contain one codex page.
which I find a little suspicious. Oh look, that's a wrong boat. Yoink. Sorry whoever owned this, it's mine now. We'll do our, our trademark Ezio Wiggle. We don't have to do the wiggle anymore, because the control does work now, but it's fun to wiggle. Who <laughs> says what, damn it, hips. I meant to sort of go up this a little more smoothly, but it seems to be working. Oh, get wrecked, guy. Don't lose him. Don't worry, you didn't lose him. You did, in fact, found him. Yeah. Uh, oh, can I not grab this? Okay, I can't grab this. Where do I go from here, though? I don't think I can grab that. Oh, I can grab that! Okay. Right. Here. Cross at the top. Yank. Hi, buddy. And do a very precarious little wiggle up there. <laughs> and have a look around Carneggio. Alright, so what has Carneggio got to offer us? Well, a codex page. And a courier assignment. We actually haven't had a, a side quest, it feels like, in ages. Um, let's go grab the codex page. I probably actually don't want to do the courier assignment until I know the map. Like, until it's all revealed. Oi! And a bunch of more viewpoints. Yes. Very true, Boom Boom. The Boom Boom speak out only the truth. Any last words for my wife? You think I'm married? I think he might have been running away. Uh. Right. Philosophical codex pages. Just coding four of these will increase your maximum health. Has that been the truth the whole time? Oh, okay. Seeing as you're right here, I guess I will do this. Who what, what? My letter was just stolen. You're not taking any business. Find the thief, kill him, bring the letter back. Please don't read it. It's from my wife, Lucia. She'd be very upset. Okay. I have to go somewhere and find someone and then probably come back. Yeah, this is why I wanted to have. Oh, look, there's a feather if I go this way. This is why I wanted to have the map open. Oh, Ezio, really? There's, there's no one else here. Where's that guy? Oh, he's running away! Where the hell did he go? He's over here. Oh, okay. Stab him! Okay, don't stab him then. Right, grab the letter. 
Right. Oh, I can read the letter that I was told not to read. Gorgio, everything is going exactly as you planned. My husband doesn't suspect. He's kept me locked away, but I persevered. I found my savior. If you're true to the passionate words whispered into my ears, you'll keep your promise to take me away from my husband. You know what you must do. Steal yourself for it. Do not waver. My husband will be at home tonight. He goes to sleep after the clock tower tolls midnight. Make sure to come in through the window. Bring one of your daggers from the barracks. We need to make sure to do this silently. I must my husband to deliver this letter to you! You're simply an unknown guard to him. The idiot will never know that he's aiding in our scheme. We'll be so happy together with that ignorant old man out of the way. Oh, wow. With great love, Lucia. Okay, now we got to get back to whoever it was who gave us this mission. Oh, Ezio. Oh, that, okay, well, this is fine, actually, because this is the way we came. Plenty of time. I can loot the things. It's over here. Uh... Oh, look, all those guys are back. Hi. Well done. I knew I could count on you. Da da da. I'm the best. Oh. Uh, they're now really upset with me for knocking that guy over, even though I didn't even see the guy. Um, there's apparently a codex page around here. Yeah. Here? Oh, that's no, literally right here. Yep. Sorry, I, yes, I, I meant a poster. Um, I'm not smart. I knew it was a poster I was after to get my notoriety down. I just have no brain. Uh, which is a, a small a small handicap in times like this. Ooh, hi guys. Oh, there's, now there's two big chunky guys in the patrols. Oh no. So what's that sparkling? Oh, it's a feather. Hello. It's good that they had that sparkling noise, otherwise I would never have noticed that. Oh, Ezio. Ezio. Don't do anything silly now. Hi, buddy. Boo. <laughs> okay. No new side quests for us. Let's go on to the next viewpoint. It is great fun doing the leaps of faith. Another poster. Oh, that. Uh, we're just gonna get wet. Um, rather than going round. Thanks. I literally just died into a haystack. Target as we did last time. And it says, I think you look great doing it. Oh, shucks. Next, buddy. Oh, I think I can see where all the other lookout points are going to be from. Block. Oh, we've only got three more viewpoints in the whole game. Oh, and a beat-up event! Wait, hang on. Oh no, I do have three. I didn't see that one, so... Blind. Yeah. Alright. Hello! I should put my 
fists on. After eight years of marriage, that video de putana is back with his old woman. Oh no! Teach him to respect his vows, please! Oh dear. Sandra on the roof. Beat up the Logan husband. Okay. I thought for a sec that that guy was just like halfway through the floor and was about to be a bit worried. Um, where? He's like up there. Okay, sure. Might get this viewpoint on the way to him. There's an archer guy, he won't be happy if he sees me. Luckily, although the street patrols seem heavier here in Kanegi or whatever it's called, the, the roof archers seem to be a little lighter so far. Oh, I... that is not where I thought we were going. Looking at it from above, I thought this white patch here was the haystack that we were aiming for. Uh, well, it said on the roof, so I guess I gotta go up, right? No, I can't climb those bricks? Okay. Oh, uh, sorry, I didn't want you. I wanted him. Oh, wow. Just doing a spin. Bump, 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 bump. I probably don't want him. Oh. I was going to say, I probably don't want him to fall off. Uh, of course. What was I thinking? My wife. I do love her. <laughs> This is exactly how you should solve all relationship disputes. It's not. Don't don't do that. <laughs> do that. Um. Right. No new side quests in the area. So onto this viewpoint, and then we're gonna backtrack a little bit. <laughs> Just for love. No. 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 It's fine. Ow. Oh look, here he is. We probably could still stab him. Release me. Uh oh. Oh, they didn't like that. Hi. Oh wait, you're a guy with a spear. Ow. I need to actually wail on you. Because I can't counter you. Ow! Right, okay. Okay, anyway. What I was actually going to do is loot all of his stuff. There's something about the delivery of the oh mama line that really gets me. Uh, where are we going? This way. Bring me your sick and wounded. I may be a bit disorganized. Bring me your sick and wounded. I may be a bit disorganized. Oh, good! Just what you want to hear from a perspective doctor. I mean, it is true of almost all of them. Uh, but still. Oh, the big old window? Shut up. I know I'm not allowed up here, and yet I am up here anyway. Oh, I don't know who that was. Somebody else saw me this time.
Oh, okay. I was not sure about my ability to get up here. Just one more viewpoint! Oh my god, we really are in the end game now. Actually, properly. Right. The music sounds tense, it knows, it knows. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. I just pushed the wrong button. It's fine. Oh, hello. Excuse me. Statues. This tower, hang on. Oh boy. That nearly went real bad, didn't it? Have I... No, no. Uh... There we go. Uh, grab, there we go. Good boy. Up, grab. Good boy. Up, grab. Up, grab once more. Up grab again, and wouldn't you know it, up grab. Up grab! Um, okay, we don't need to up grab anymore. Uh, around here. You last steps. Onto the cross, my buddy. Onto the top. This is it! Our last look at Venice from above. Any more side quests before I head back? No, but there is a convenient boat right here. It's a fast travel point for us. It's like they knew we were coming, chap. Whee! Box man. Uh, uh, yes, we're going to Montevideo. We do now have all of the codex pages. Throw an enemy to a breakable object to kill him. We haven't done that very much. I liked doing it a lot with Altair. There's less opportunities for it in this, and you spend a lot less time actually with someone grabbed. Bring your sick and wounded. Yeah. Okay, the grabbing just doesn't flow well with the combat, and most enemies can stop you from grabbing them anyway. Leonardo, hi! It's my boy, Jack. Hi! Leonardo, Aww. Ezio, so good to see you. How can I help you? Haha! <laughs> you found another one! How exciting! Put it down. If you transpose this word and move this line to the left, it's deciphered. Oh, wow. God, that was so simple. I could I could probably have done that myself if you just if it's just transposing one word and moving a line to the left. <laughs> okay. Oh, everyone's here. Hi guys. Uh Well, this is ominous. Ezio! It is time, uncle. 
Let us finish what you and my father started all those years ago. Indeed. Altair started Perhaps even more. Now we can finally make sense of this prophecy and put a stop to whatever it is the Spaniard is plotting. We should start by locating the vault. The codex pages will lead us to it. Well, they so far they haven't done very much. Decipher the codex pages to discover the location of the vault. Sure. Vision. And then this is the. Oh, the wrong button. Why do our instincts insist on violence? I've studied the interactions between different species. The innate desire to survive seems to demand the death of the other. Why can they not stand hand in hand? So many believe the world was created by the hand of a divine power, but I see only the designs of a madman bent on celebrating destruction and desperation. Our origins seem chaotic, unintended. Purpose and being is still solely by the passage of time. Posed first by nature and later men. Dot dot dot. Uh, we'll spin it into place. Oh, we never got to see the finished map. Collecting all the plays with the light on the final moment. Sure. Oh, what's this? Oh, the apple. I see. It is a map of the entire world, <laughs> but there are lands shown here that do not exist. What do you Apparently recognize they do that as being a map of the world? I imagine they've yet to be discovered, or rediscovered. How is this possible? Perhaps the vault will hold the answer. Do you see where it is then? No, it can't be. The vault. It looks like the vault is in Roma, then the Spaniard. Oh dear. This is why he became Pope. Now I understand. It's not the vault alone he's gained access to, but the staff as well. What staff? The Codex always spoke of two keys. Two pieces of Eden needed to open the vault. One is the apple. Uh -huh. The other is the staff. <laughs> Equal staff. The paper oh my staff gosh. is the second piece of Eden. For years, no, decades, we've sought these answers. And now, at last, we have them. But so too could the Spaniard. And if he does... If he finds a way into the vault, its contents will make the apple seem a trifling thing. <laughs> I must go to Roma and find the vault. What are the rest of you? We'll do what we do best. Cause some trouble in the city, giving you the freedom to conduct your search. Just let me know when you are ready, Nipote. For a sec, I misread that and thought he was going to call him Nipple. <laughs> Just let me know when you're ready, Nipple. Hi. Well, I don't have Roma to do. At you. Let me know when you are ready to depart. I am ready to depart. You sure you want to go to Rome? Yeah. Wait, but I've got all of the lookout towers. Does that mean there aren't lookout towers in Rome? Question mark? <laughs> You're not wrong, Boom Boom. You're not wrong. <laughs> Roma, 1499. It looks like there's a lot of city here to explore. Bocca, or possibly Bocca al Luca. Infiltrate the Sistine Chapel, assassinate the Spaniards. Oh, I guess I just have the map, apparently, already. It looks different to all the other maps, though, which is a bit weird. Uh, do I need to go up? <laughs> and start to go, this isn't the most promising. No, nope, I can't find that. Up here? No. Nope. Sorry, I'm I'm obviously missing something very important. Uh Okay, hang on. Onto this. Maybe? And then onto this, these bricks? Nope. 
Okay, those bricks aren't climbable either. What? <laughs> Am I? Am I being unusually dense? Oh, let's see. Oh, you fool. Right wall, wrong bricks, apparently. Let's try again. Oh yeah, look, there's the, the dark colored bricks over there. There we go, thank you for being. Uh, hmm. Can I really grab that? Ooh, okay, apparently I can. Uh, here. Yeah, there's guys on the roof here. Castel San Angelo. Built between 135 and 139 as the tomb of the Roman Emperor Hadrian. Castel San Angelo was designed to be slightly larger than the mausoleum of Augustus. Because size does matter. Oh dear. The building was converted into a military fortress in 401, was promptly sacked in 410, who scattered Hadrian's ashes everywhere. What was left was recycled, i.e. stolen by the Vatican. 14th century, the tomb was converted into a castle for the popes, connected to St. Peter's via a covered passage called the Passetto de Borgo. Collecting the delightfully sadistic side of the Renaissance papal rule, the castle contained both sumptuous apartments and a prison. Giordano Bruno, the famous scientist and hermeticist, was held there for six years. Executions were carried out in the small interior courtyard for the pope's enjoyment. Marvellous. And oh god, there's a guy there. Hi. Didn't even know you were there. No. Nope. Okay. Do -do. Look, I'm playing a stealth game stealthily. The Basilica de San Pietro. Built in 326, as opposed to the epic basilica that exists today, it was constructed in the form of a Latin cross. An atrium, called the Garden of Paradise, stood at the entrance, beckoning followers through the main doorways of the church. Unlike pagan temples, which were lavishly decorated, the facade of St. Peter's was plain. Thankfully, Catholicism got over all that when they made the new St. Peter's. The downside was that the religion became incredibly corrupt, but hey, beauty has to come at a price. <laughs> Thank you, Bimu, for stealth. Uh, the Basilica was built on top of the old Circus of Nero. Before you start pulling out your popcorn and cotton candy, this wasn't a modern circus. The Roman crucifixions of Christians were the main act. St. Peter, among many others, was hung up to die there. The Basilica was built on, this, on top of this anti-Christian site as almost an intentional modification of history by Emperor Constantine. Because if it no longer exists, it never happened. Oh, wow, that guy is unusually blind. Oh, and that gave me some notoriety doing that. Who do you think he's from? That could be our man. Not you. Oh, ah, what? I pushed the button. I pushed the counter button. Rude. Down one health already, which isn't a great start, if I'm honest. Wow, okay, these guys have nothing. That's fine. I don't really want to go through there. I'd much sort of rather go up and over, but apparently that's not an option. Luckily, there's only two of them. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no! Uh, uh, okay. I f it's really annoying that you can't jump across these. Really annoying. It says, oh, yeah, you do also have your 20 year old health potions. That's true. Oh, I see. I can't climb up any of these because they have the little spikes at the top, you see. It prevents me from going over. There's anti climb features, which. Oh, hi. You are. Unusually, 
I'm observant. It also feels like there's lots of climbing paraphernalia over there, which I never... It's not for anything. Uh, oh, there's lots of guys here. Can I use any? Oh, okay. I was hoping to get two of them, ideally. Ow, 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 ow. Ow! Oh, there's an archer. I hate archers. Where's the archer? Where's the archer? Right, you. Okay. Now I've got him to stop shooting at me. We can go back to the way I'm Ow! Now if I can see, I can stab some people. I don't actually know how much health potions restore. Do they restore all my health, or do they only restore a bit of my health? I don't know if I've ever actually used one. Says a decent amount. Okay, I probably don't need to use one yet. Uh, my notoriety is going up. Which isn't great. I like how the, the very opening bit was like, oh yeah, you can stealth this. Everything's subsequently. Nope, no stealth for you. Oh, Hossy. Oh, that was probably quite painful. Oh, hello. I really hope you can jump this! Okay, he can jump this. Ow. Ow, I can't get back on! Get back on the horse! Okay, we're gonna not do the amount of combat. Oh, fuck me, the gate's closed. I hope that wasn't like a time limit thing. Oh, Ezio, please! Faster than that, Ezio. Oh, okay. Clink, clank, clink. Right. Okay. Uh, is there a way to open the gate from up here? No. I guess I just have to drop down? Question mark? No! Who saw me? I can't even see. Oh, there was a haystack there. I found him. Get your sword out, Ezio! Ow! Ow. Stab the guy! Stab the guy harder than that, please, Ezio! Ow! Oh my god, I'm getting wrecked! Ezio is so useless sometimes! Right, I guess I can't use my horse from here on out, so it's foot only. Makes me wonder why they bothered giving me a horse in the first place, to be honest. Can I sneak around over the edge? Phenomenal. <laughs> this is exactly how this was supposed to be done. God, I need to hold on for a second, have a drink, because my throat's already dying.
All right, I hope you weren't expecting any tension during this part because you won't you know be getting it. I also seem to still be holding my sword. I don't quite know how that works. Okay, that was weird. Never mind. If we had met that one woman who told us the super jump, we would have been so stuck. Sneak it, Zio. Yoink! Oh wow! That gave me loads of notoriety doing that. Uh. Now where are we go? Into the haystack? Probably into the haystack. Oh, okay. Can I not? Can I not reach the haystack from here? Oh, that's like a. Oh. Hi guys. I can't drop a sassy them either. This feels set up to do a, 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 a leap of faith. But I can't. I'm gonna go down the slow way. Ow. Not. Uh, okay, I gotta figure out how. I gotta quickly figure out how to use the potions, which I've never ever used. It would also help if I actually blocked attacks when pushing the block button. Then. I'm not quite sure how I did use the potion, but I used the potion. Turkey, sneaky, sneaky. This guy didn't notice a sword fight going on over there. <laughs> I feel like this is not how I was supposed to be doing this scene. I also feel like my notoriety shouldn't be going up this much considering what I'm doing, but hey ho. Sneak. This is so sneaky. No one will ever know. Get down now. Guards are now on high alert. Go back down as you. Sure, I'll do something like that. He says, I think killing you around that battle would make you quite notorious. That's true! It, it, it feels like my notoriety is only going up when I do the stealthy assassinations and not when I do the not stealthy ones. I feel like avoiding them now would give me more problems later. Oh! Really? You pulled some other guys out? Ah! Whale on him! Whale on him! Ow! Ow! See how do something! I'M PUSHING BUTTONS, DO SOMETHING! Or that! That works too, I guess. It's not what you're being asked to do, but it works. Ow! Oh, now you dodge! Sure. Ah! 
We got him. Okay. Ow. That was a painful encounter. Alright. Remain undetected. Well, I'd love to. I've been trying to. I did tell that group of four guys was was turning their back. It just the game didn't care. <laughs> they noticed me anyway. Oops, I need to steal from that guy. Okay. Uh why are you Oh. Why? Why? I didn't do anything to you. I did something to that guy, sure. I didn't do anything to you. <laughs> I didn't rob him. Okay, well, I didn't push any buttons to rob him. F off, mate! I can't get him to reset, is the thing. Hello? Are you here to... Ah, brute. To bother me? Ah, You're just running... I've had a little cosmic joke. Why me? Always in the wrong place at the wrong time. Damn, so do get out of here. Bella Madonna, I want no part of this. Right, now everyone is upset with you. Absolutely everyone is completely terrified of you. Because of that one guy. Gotta try and sneak all the way up to this group. Blend with them. Alright, and then stab this guy. Cool. Okay. Well. Uh, oh, there's a guy there. I'm going to need to be hidden from. Oh, are you kidding me? Okay. Alright. We've got to be very, very cautious, I guess. And we also can't hit the X button to fast walk at any point, because if we do, we will accidentally steal from people. Which was honestly a very foolish thing to put on the same button. That's the be sneaky button. Well, what am I supposed to do from here? Exactly. What am I supposed to do from here? Oh, okay, hang on. Oh, there's a group of monks over there! Ah, okay, so I can hide on the other side of this, potentially. 
dust. Ah, okay, I see. I think. I think I gotta stab this guy. But I, I feel like that's gonna cause everyone to spook. And I won't have any good hiding spots. Blown it? Because hidden blade assassinating isn't stealthy, and poison assassinating will make him do crazy stuff. I think either in either of those cases I won't be able to blend. to this kill Rodrigo Budger without being detected. Oh my god. Well, at least the game is acknowledging that it's a stealth game now. Because... Capella Sestina. Inspired by the architecture of Solomon's Temple, the Sistine Chapel is the most famous room in the Apostolic Palace, the Pope's Vatican residence. The chapel's famous ceiling frescoes did not yet exist in 1503, so no climbing across the finger of God. But the wall paintings that line the chapel, painted by Pietro Perugino, Sandro Botticelli, and Domenico Gerlandio, among others, are an ample consolation prize. As the Pope's personal chapel, Mass is frequently held inside, as are the papal conclaves, which occur after the Pope's death. Cardinals are locked inside the chapel and are not permitted to leave until a new pope is elected. Only through smoke signals sent the opportunity to announce the new pope can they escape. Worst of all horrors, no cardinals, unless ill, can be attended inside by more than one servant. That's just cruel. Et in unum dominum Jesum Christum, filium de ingenitum. Okay. Et patre natum ante omnia saecula. So. Deum de Deo, lumen de lumine. Deum verum de Deo vero. Genitum non factum consubstantiarem patri, prequem omnia facta sunia, qui propter nos homines et propter nostram salutem descendit de celis. Et incarnatus est Christus Sanctus, I'm going to be detected when I drop on people. Ex Maria Virgine et omnia facta sunia. That does sometimes happen when you drop on people from in front. Crucifixus et siam pro nobis. But I've got no choice, because I can't get close to this. Et sepulti. Hello! beyond this but I'm not I've waited too long lost too much <laughs> requiescat in pace you bastard I don't think so what oh I see he's got the stuff which makes him immune to being stabbed in the neck <laughs> phenomenal to resist I see kind of you to bring me the apple now give it here <laughs> <laughs> oh is the fighter just like your father well rejoice my child for you will see him again soon you will give it to me as you wish uh oh I was, I was supposed to be like, it's a shame I can't use, like, cool Apple of Eden effects. But apparently I can. <laughs> Fascinating. An impressive power, this. But if you think it's going to save you, you've another thing coming. Okay. Stab him? I've killed this guy so many times now. This will be the fifth time. 
I'll cut you down, assassin. Will you? I mean, my, my friend assassins aren't helping very much. I will say that. Ow. Okay, apparently I can't dodge that. Ow! Ezio, when I push the dodge button, you please dodge! Don't know, as long as the game actually lets me dodge. And no longer. See when I get hits in, they're good hits. You are right to fear me. Wreck uh, him! Ow! Or don't wreck him! One of the two! Ow! A clever trick, but useless. Yeah, apparently. Everything is a bit useless right now. This is an extremely annoying fight. You are right to fear me. I I just can't dodge that that attack where he knocks me down. I've got no defense against it. No, you will not take this from me. <laughs> it's finished, Rodrigo. Lay down your arms, and I will make sure the end comes sweetly. Hmm. Really, Ezio. And would you give up so easily were it the other way around? Right, okay, that's Why enough. We're gonna have to kill him a sixth time. <laughs> oh. He's invisible. Ugh. At last. Oh my god, Ezio. Oh my god. And now, to deal with you. Oh, rip Ezio, I guess. Find the secret passage. Oh my god, okay, apparently I'm just fine after that? Target located? Is it? Oh, look, it's here, okay. Assassinate Rodrigo and recover the pieces of Eden. Game, I've tried. I have tried so many times. <laughs> okay, I promise you. What is this place? Uh, a good question. Very spooky. Oh, okay. Apparently, I can't change weapons. I can't get my hidden blades out, which is going to make assassinating anyone kind of awkward. Open, damn you! Open! It's over. Rodrigo. Ezio, you've literally no been stabbed. Tricks. No more ancient artifacts. No more weapons. No more weapons? Let us see what you are made of, old man. Um. All right then. If that's uh... how you want to play it. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna fist fight him what now. Do you even want with Rodrigo? Don't you know what lies within? Or do you mean to tell me? The great and powerful assassins didn't figure it out. Figure what out? God. It's God that dwells within. How? You expect me to believe that God lives beneath the Vaticano? A more logical point, location point, than a kingdom point, and a cloud, don't point. you think? Surrounded by singing angels and cherubim <laughs> makes for a lovely image. But the truth is far more interesting. 
Let's say I was to believe you. What do you think you'll do when you open no, that I door? I can't see. I can't see. I don't care. It's not approval I'm after. Just power. And you think you'll give it up? Whatever lies beyond that wall won't be able to resist the staff and apple. They were made for felling gods. <laughs> wow. God is meant to be all knowing, all powerful. You think a couple of ancient relics can harm him? You know nothing, boy. You take your image of the creators of an ancient book. A book, mind you, written by men. You are the Pope. Point, point, Can point. you dismiss the central text of Just your keep faith? wailing on them. <laughs> are you so naive? I became Pope because it gave me access. It gave me power. Do you think I believe a single goddamn word of that ridiculous book? I mean, that it's would be conventional for Pope. Just like every other religious tract written over the past 10,000 years. Press stab. I'm pressing stab. Okay. Did me pressing stab help there at all? Okay, this is the sixth time we've you killed can't. him now. You can't. It's my destiny. My. I am the prophet. I think you're the you step three were. question mark question mark question mark actually. Get it over with then. No. Oh you my God, Ezio! My are you back. kidding me? I'm done. Nulla è reale, tutto è lecito. Requiescat in pace. We've killed him six times, and we're not even going to let him die. Oh, hello. Shininess. Oh, we seem to have a lot more luck than he did. Are we going to just leave this here in the room with him? Oh, I don't even have... I literally am only wearing my fists because I took all the other weapons off. I can't even punch this guy. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me, Ezio? Six times killing him wasn't enough. You need to come back for a seventh, do you? Are you sure? Are you really sure, Ezio, that you don't want to kill this man? <laughs> oh my god. Uh All right. This is very spooky alien -y. Greetings, prophet. Oh, hello. It is good you have come. Let us see it to give thanks. Let us see what. Oh, the apple. Apparently I had that even though it was in the staff. Question mark. We must speak. They don't want to see the stuff. Are you? They only want to see that. Names. When I died, it was Minerva. Before that, Mulva and Nera. And on and on. The others, too. Juno, who was before called Uni. Jupiter, who was before called Tinia. You are specifically gods. the Roman gods. <laughs> no, not gods. We simply came before. Even when we walked the world, your kind struggled to understand our existence. We were more advanced in time. Your minds were not yet ready. Still not. Maybe never. No matter. You may not comprehend us. But you will comprehend our warning. You must. None of what you are saying makes sense. Our words are not meant for you. <laughs> what are you talking about? Hello. There's no one else here. Enough. I do not wish to speak with you, but to you. You are the prophet. You've played your part. You anger him, but please, be silent. 
that we may commune. Okay. Hi. Listen. Sure, I'm listening. Good job. Good, good job. When we were okay. still flesh and our home still whole, your kind betrayed us. We who made you. We who gave you life. Oh, okay. We were strong, but you were many. And both of us craved war. That seems so busy silly. were we with earthly <laughs> concerns, we failed to notice the heavens. Oh, and by the time the we did, the world burned until naught remained but ash. It should have ended then and there. But we built you in our own image. We right. built you to survive. And so we did. Few were our numbers. Your kind and mine. Uh -huh. It took sacrifice. Oh, I'm in like strength, a spooky. But we rebuilt. Oh, hi. And as life returned to the world, we endeavored to ensure this tragedy would not be repeated. Right. But now we are dying, and time will work against us. Truth turned into myth and legend. What we built, misunderstood. Let my words preserve the message and make a record of our loss. I'm not gonna lie, you haven't really said anything useful. Also so. bring hope. You must find the other temples, built by those who knew to turn away from war. They worked to protect us, to save us from the fire. If you can find them, if their work can be saved, so too might this world. What's coming to end the world? Be quick. That would be a helpful thing short. to know. And guard against the cross, for there are many who will stand in your way. Oh, look, that's the Abstergo logo. What a useless warning! I didn't it understand almost anything. The message <laughs> is delivered. We are gone now from this world. All of us. We can do no more. The rest is up to you, Desmond. Huh. What? Who is Desmond? I don't understand. Please, wait. I have so many questions. Poor Ezio. Poor Ezio. What the fuck? I think it's interesting that they're setting Desmond up as this, like, important person to deliver all these messages to, considering that he's dead by the time of the fourth game. Oh, well, not the fourth game, but the game numbered four. Um, I understand that there was like a change in direction where they lost direction with the Assassin's Creed franchise, but like, come on, guys, come on. I like that. Ten minutes until I get all of my equipment ready to go before they do. Hello? Desmond. Yeah. Hi. Yeah. All right, Sean, I need you and Rebecca to get everything in here packed up and loaded into the truck. You and I will deal with the Templars. What, they're here? It was only a matter of time before they discovered us. To be honest, I'm surprised it took them as long as it did. Let's go. Oh, stabbing gloves. We're gonna be stabbing. I what, was sort of expecting the, the credits to not be on screen when the stabbing started. So what's the plan? We ditch this place and then what? There's another safe house. It's, it's got company. Okay. I don't really know where I'm going. The just up ahead. I don't know where you've gone, and I'm stuck on these things. Hello, lady. Thank you. Mr. Miles. Oh, it's this you. Is Hi. An unexpectedly pleasant turn of events. And here I thought I'd have to waste more men on you. Kind of you to save me. The trouble. What do you want, Vidic? For you to come home. <laughs> we miss you terribly. There's still so much work for us to do together. It's not happening, Warren. You continue to disappoint in every conceivable way, Miss Stillman. I saved your life once. Do you remember? Uh -huh. And no, this I don't. <laughs> is how you repay me? You saved me so you could keep experimenting on people, destroying their lives. And for what? Oh. This tired argument again. As I recall, you were there, at my side, every step of the way. 
Their blood is on your hands just as much as mine. You need to stop him. I'm on it. Okay. Uh, I'd like to stop, please. Hello? Okay. I'm not allowed to fight. Uh, hello? <laughs> wow! Hey, okay, we worked it out. Hey, we've got stabbing controls again now. I think these are the first people Desmond's killed himself, right? Did he, I, I don't think we killed anyone in our escape. Where did, did it go? Wait, you want us alive? How? So we're just gonna kill all your mates? I really wish I'd spent a lot more time practicing the, the instant kill counters now. Because <laughs> we're gonna need them. Ow. Ow. Luckily, I don't think I have a health bar. What is the timing on this? Alright, we're gonna stab him? Is he in the truck? Will we... Good job. Uh -oh, Doc. Looks like it's just you and me now. Enjoy your victory, Mr. Miles. Temporary as it is. Desmond, we have to go. Can't we? Oh, okay, he's gone. Wasn't hey, that our escape on. truck? Help Lucy into the van. Oh, we have a different Hurry, van. Hurry, Desmond, we need okay. to go. <laughs> You'll have your time. Oh my Desmond. God. Warren's gonna get what he deserves. I promise. I like how easy so that sequence would have been for either There's side if they'd had north. guns. We should be safe there, at least for a little while. I have to analyze those tapes from your session, figure out what's happening. You have to and figure out how to make a plot for another I'll game in 12 up. months. Got a long drive ahead of us. <laughs> you might want to play around with the Animus on the way. All right, but I got some questions first. I mean, what the hell was that in the vault? What you saw proves everything I was afraid of. The Templars aren't our biggest threat, not by a long shot. So what, the sun is? What's it gonna do, cook the earth? I doubt it, but I don't know. There's been some speculation that the earth's magnetic field is weakening. Right. A sufficiently strong flare could flip the poles and cause a geomagnetic reversal. It's all theoretical, but if it happens, the planet could become geologically unstable. That's Very not how that works. It's meant to be the stuff of pseudoscience, but clearly something catastrophic happened to the people of the first civilization. Minerva, was it? She seemed to think we were due for a second round. Not sure her warning was that specific. We're but fine. sure. <laughs> she... so these games are pre we'll keep reviewing That's the tapes. And you can keep digging through your memories. Maybe there's more to discover. Alright. So I better get started. <laughs> that was a really fun game, with I must admit, an extremely disappointing ending. Uh I think the ending to the DLC bit was much more satisfying than the ending to the actual game. You know, I, I, it felt like they were sort of constrained by the fact that they didn't know what the plot of the series was going to be. So they could only offer sort of the most generic of warnings and the most sort of generic spooky speculation bits that didn't really mean anything in the big final climactic moments, which felt a bit sad, to be honest. And actually, after killing the guy six times, it would have been nice to actually kill him. But 
we will sit and we will watch some credits, and then we will have about half a sweet worth of time to uh, to go and find something else to do. And I do want to sit to the credits because I did enjoy playing it, even though there were bits that were scuffed and stuff. Like, it was a fun game. It was a good game to look at as well. Like, Italy is pretty in this game. And it makes me excited for Assassin's Creed 2 2. <laughs> AKA Brotherhood. Is it Brotherhood that's the second one? I think it's Brotherhood that's the second Assassin's Creed 2. Uh, I do not think that Brotherhood will be the next game we play in our Man Hit slash Man Assassin Monday slot. I think I'm going to play Spirit of Thief because I really enjoyed the demo of that. I do want to get around to playing it. And. After that, we may return to the franchise, or we may find something else. Yes, this Oh, so many credits. Lots of people are involved in making games like this. It does show. It's just a shame that a few more of them weren't story writers. <laughs> the end. <laughs> Sp specifically, story writers for the end of the game. Ah. <laughs> oh. Annie Morneau, who was in charge of producing DNA. Uh. <laughs> Sorry, that, that, excuse, that, that being stupid. Um, we have Ubisoft Annecy. I don't even know where Annecy is, but I mean, I'm guessing it's in France, given that they're all French names and the uh, Ubisoft brackets France. Soft proper people. Oh my gosh, so many credits. I also hope this isn't a looping set of credits because I won't know if it's for quite some time. <laughs> I'm going to use this opportunity to have a wee bit of drink. I recommend people in chat grab a drink and a snack, maybe. Uh, there'll be a little a little wrap-up of this. And uh, once the credits finish, we'll be moving on. I'll probably pick up some more Call of the Wilds, because it's a good game to just sort of slot in uh, to loose times like this. Uh, and to anybody who is watching this on the board and has Presumably, I sort of would have hoped, watched, I guess, now the entirety of Assassin's Creed 2 on my bots. Uh, thank you for watching along, if you have been. Uh, thank you to all of those of you who've left likes. Uh, I do see them. Uh, it does It does make me think, oh, it's nice that people like this, when people like something. <laughs> that sounds like a really stupid and, and, and meaningless thing to say, but I promise you it's true. Uh, I, I do pay attention. Well, special thanks now. I want to say special thanks to all of you. <laughs> oh. See, they use Adobe Flash, they use Bink Video, which I've never heard of. They, like everyone and their mother, use this Dolby Digital surround sound. I don't exactly know what Dolby Digital even do, but every everyone and everything uses it, so it must be a very important piece of software. <laughs> I do feel like this was maybe another set of credits that could have been improved by making it twice as wide and actually using the whole screen. Now we're at warranties, which really is close to the end.
All right, and that is it for me. So, till the Vodlings, thank you so much for being here, and I will see you all next time.